Hey everyone, how are you guys doing today? Today is Monday, May 25th, 2009, Memorial Day. Happy Memorial Day to everybody out there. Hope you have a wonderful day. And today I have a review to do for you guys on the live speaker um, for the lineup of iPod products, at or at least most of them. But before I go ahead and get into this review, I would like to give a quick shout out to TD Instructor. TD Instructor. Um, she's actually a girl reviewer over here on YouTube. She um, she does all different kinds of tech reviews. She's got a bunch of unboxings. So she's she's got some epic case reviews. Uh, I believe she just finished up a giveaway. So go. Her link will be over there in the video description. Subscribe if you like what she's doing. Um, it's basically it, guys. So let's go ahead and get on into this, guys. Alright guys, so like I said, I'm here with you guys with the live speaker here from LiveSpeaker.com as you guys can obviously see there. A um, couple of brief things I want to go over before I go into this product. It's not spelled with an ER by the way guys, it's live speaker just like that. And also some of you are uh, wanting to know on the unboxing video why it did say iPod Touch 3G. That's just a typo guys, um, it probably meant to say iPod Touch 2G. You guys can see they were going down there naming them all. It was probably just a typo, so nothing big. Alright, so now let's go ahead and open this baby up. Um, I just want to go ahead and thank live speaker for sending this over. All right. So when you first get this product, guys, it comes in a very nice, style, stylish, reusable uh, traveling box, if you wish. comes with a nice little manual right here as well. All right. Under that, you then have your live speaker. You guys can see it right here is the live speaker itself. I'll put that off to the side. <clears throat> and if you didn't catch the unboxing video, it also comes with this little traveling pack or pouch as well. Right there, live speaker and also comes with the charging USB for this device and it also comes with a USB AC adapter in case you want to go ahead and plug it into your wall and it also has an indicator light which is awesome so you know when it's charging and when it's uh, done charging okay so let's just go ahead and place this box off to the side right there for now okay I'll put the products here okay once again, here's the pouch and the accessories, just in case you guys are wondering. Okay. And now let's go ahead. You guys saw that. You guys know what comes with it. Let's go ahead and get with the product itself. All right. So here you guys can see is the live speaker itself. Um, it is um, a speaker system that works with the iPod Classic, the iPhone Original, the iPhone 3G, the iPod Touch 1G, and 2G. Some of you guys are wondering in the unboxing video, uh, does it charge your iPod as well? No. I just want to get that all across there, guys. It doesn't charge. It is just for speakers. Just like any other portable speaker, um, it doesn't charge your iPod. It just uses it as a speaker system. Um, not that much of a doubtful. I don't really mind that whatsoever because it is portable, guys. You can take this wherever you want. No strings, no wires attached. You don't have to worry about that. You can go outside, listen to your music. You don't have to worry about um, finding an outlet to plug it in or anything like that or finding some AA batteries and putting them in there and running out. Um, it comes with a rechargeable, which is in there. You're not going to take it out, but it has a rechargeable battery that you obviously charge with the USB like I showed you. Um, it charges in about I don't know, it took me about an hour or two to charge it um, to what I had to take it till it was full. And um, it lasts for around 14 to 17 hours, guys, on a full charge. Uh, so that is a great charge time. All right. So let me go ahead. I'm going to, for this video, I'm going to demonstrate it using my iPod Touch 2G. I do have a skin on there for music skins. Okay. So before I go ahead and throw that into their Super Cradle, I want to show you how the Super Cradle works. As you guys can see here, it has a little diagram right there. It's letting you know that's where you're going to put your iPod or iPhone. Okay. So what this Super Cradle does, it allows um, all other iPods to fit in there by using this little design right here, which goes down to form to whatever iPod you happen to be putting in there. So that is a, cool, a very cool thing right there. You don't need to get different docks or different cradles for different iPods. All right. They're all going to fit in this one Super Cradle. Okay. So now let's go ahead and just slide this off. To slide this cradle off, all you have to do is push away from you. You guys hear that click, and now it comes off. And when you originally get this product, this wire is going to be routed up here through. Let me guys go ahead and show you once I push it in there. 
It's going to be routed through the iPhone one. This will be like that because the iPhone's headphone port is at the top of the iPhone. The iPods are all at the bottom for the iPod Touch and the other iPods that this uh, product works with. So very simply, you just want to go ahead and take this, push it down into the little crevice, okay? And then take your super cradle right here. You have those four holes and these four little slots where it's going to go ahead and lock into place. You got to do is find those just like that, pull towards you. You'll hear click, you're ready to go. Your cradle and your headphone port is at the bottom where you're gonna go ahead and plug in your iPod into, okay? So now, very simply, to go ahead, take your iPod, slide it in from the top down, just like this. You guys will then see that your iPod is securely in there. It's not gonna come out unless you like vigorously shake it. You guys can see I'm really shaking it uh, really hard right here. And it's still not coming out. So your iPod is in there pretty well, okay? Very simply, just go ahead and take your headphone uh, cable that it comes with, plug it into the bottom of the iPod just like that, push it in there, and now guys you're ready to go with your live speaker, alright? So let's go over a couple more things before I go ahead and start playing some music and let you guys see how great this thing sounds, alright? On top here you have your power on and off, you have the USB charging port right there, that's where you're going to go ahead and plug in the USB cable to go ahead and charge it. Okay, let's go ahead and move on here to the back. Here is on the back, you guys can see the silver part. This is the stand that it also doubles as. All right, so you guys can see this little piece right here. You go ahead and just pull that out right there. Or you can go ahead and slide this down just like that. Then go ahead and pull that out. All right, then you have the kickstand right here, which you can put into any one of these three little ports right here. I, I like the uh, middle one. I think that's how it looks best when it stands. And then you can just go to place your iPod down anywhere or iPhone, and it's going to look great, guys. It's going to stand by itself, and it's going to look great. Um, this, you can definitely rock this on your desk. If you buy the I, the uh, white one that they also have, you can put it in office. The black one, too. Uh, you can put it in office, and it's going to look great, guys. It's going to look legit. Um, you can have music playing. You can have a calendar up. You can really have whatever you want. Okay? Uh, there are also two other settings, which are this one and the one that is a little bit more laid back, that one. Alright, you guys can see that. Uh, you guys can probably barely see the kickstand from the angle that my camera's at, but you guys can see how a kickstand kind of throws it up on a perfect angle for your viewing, which is great. Alright, so let's go ahead and put it back to that middle one. Alright. So now we have the kickstand in use, and our iPod is ready to go. It's going to power on the device. And the cool thing about this is, when you go ahead and throw your iPod into the portrait mode right here, fully up and down with you, um, you don't have to worry about anything touching the ground or getting in the way. Uh, your iPod is clearly off, up, off, up, off the surface that you actually have your live speaker on. So let's go ahead and just let me uh, lower the camera angle down a little bit for you guys, so you get a little better view of this product. All right. So now you guys can see here the live speaker is ready to go. It's ready to play music. It's on. It's plugged in. So now all you have to do is go ahead and start the music that you want to play. The first song that I'm going to play for you guys is by. Let me see if I can get that right there. Mario. Let me see. Uh, excuse me. Not Mario. Uh, Manio featuring T Pain. Sorry if I'm saying the name wrong. Uh, featuring T Pain. All the above. Full credit. Everything goes to them. Okay. Let's go ahead. And just click play. You guys can see here that the sound does sound pretty well. It's only three fourths about the way up, so it's not going to be that loud. But if you go ahead and turn it up a little bit more, you guys can definitely see a big, significant uh, difference in sound quality and the um, the. Uh, let's. What do I want to say here, guys? You you can definitely tell that it gets much much louder with uh, just barely turning it up that much. You guys can definitely tell that it gets much louder, um, and it definitely is noticeable. The sound quality doesn't really differ that much. It sounds great. It sounds nice and crisp. Doesn't get all fuzzy like other speakers may when you turn it all the way up. So that's an awesome quality about this live speaker system right here as well. And now the main thing about this live speaker system, which you're loud, which you're available to do because of the way that they go ahead and designed it. If you want to watch a movie, obviously you guys are saying, all right, well now I can't watch the movie. I have to turn it back this way, and it's going to block the speakers a little bit. No, guys. Here's what you can do. Go ahead and keep turning your iPod to the left, and watch the speakers. I'm going to try and do this without getting in the way of you guys' view of this. Go ahead, hold the live speaker device, and turn your iPod at the same time, and watch watch the speakers, guys. 
the speakers move out with your iPod. You can see right here from the back that they just extended that much on either side of the device itself. So now, when you're watching a movie or anything, like along the lines of that, you're not muffling the sound. Your iPod is not blocking the speakers whatsoever. You are in perfect view of your speakers. All right, so let's go ahead and play it. Once again, all the above, same song right there. But if you want to go ahead and watch a video, guys, this is the perfect viewing mode if you're going to go ahead and watch a video. All right, go ahead and just move it back. It goes in by itself. You don't need to pull it out or anything like that. Uh, if you do pull it out, though, by by hands, make sure you pull it in. Uh, push it in as well with your hands and not move the iPod. They went ahead and made that clear on the tutorial that they had on their website. Um, just thought I would let you guys know that. Uh, there's not much really I can cover more with this, guys. You guys can see it does have a nice white glossy finish to it. It's going to show fingerprints, but easily just go ahead and wipe them away. You guys can probably see here a couple scratches on the back. That's just because I brought it outside and uh, it did get a little bit scratched up. But, guys, this is a great product if you need this. What I mainly use it for, guys, is when I'm outside playing basketball or anything like that with my friends. I'll bring this outside. I'll set up my iPod in the corner. <laughs> Go ahead, play some music, and we're ready to go. We don't have to worry about it or anything like that. This is a great product, guys, for indoors or outdoor use. Um, you can sell by the slideshow they have on their website that it's great for indoor or outdoor use. Uh, the sound quality sounds amazing, guys. Even when you turn it up all the way, once again. You guys can tell it sounds great. Um, you're probably not getting as much clarity as I am because of it's been going through the camera and then going through the editing, then going through YouTube and everything like that. But guys, right here, right now, this product sounds great. The quality of it is amazing. Um, it's made amazing. The, the design with the swivel right there is great. Definitely a product for you guys to go ahead and check out if you need a portable speaker uh, that has a great charge, great long-lasting battery life. Definitely go ahead and check this out. I believe it's on sale for around 80 five dollars on their website um definitely make sure you go ahead and check it out not a bad price for this really great sound and it's portability guys so definitely go ahead and check this product out i will catch you guys in my next video once again it's available in white and in black as you guys can see right here uh, i will catch you guys later favorite card subscribe peace guys i'll catch you guys later once again all the above peace